Okay, uh, welcome to another one of my informal videos, uh, just to show you a few pickups I've got and some stuff that's been delivered this morning, including this lovely goodiness. Oh yes, that should be fun. But before I deal with that, <coughs> there have been a few uh, accusations going around the internet from one particular person. Uh, he's called Arcade Meister. Hang on. Lovely cup of tea there. Yes, Arcade Meister. That's A R C A D E M E I S T E R. All one word. Now, this brute has been accusing me of being addicted. Hang on. Addicted to tea. I would like to say it is, but its accusations are baseless, unfounded, but probably completely true. I am British after all. When we like tea. But that's something for the solicitors to deal with. So anyway, right. First of all, we have... <coughs> I'm dropping down. Let me so I can reach him better. Right, okay. First of all, we have on the PlayStation... Uh, 007 Racing. One English pound. In a charity shop, locally. Uh, had a go of it. Got really frustrated with the handling of the car. But uh, I'll be going back on it and having a look at it. Might review it someday, but I don't think this one will be a priority for reviewing. That's that one. Next up, Siphon Filter for the PlayStation. One English pound again. Uh, had a bit of a wonder around it. It's a, uh, as you can see, first uh, player shoot em up. with all your missions and stuff, so uh, I've had a quick go of it. Didn't see anything uh, outstanding, but I didn't get that far, so I'll have a go of that. And the star of the show, well, for this little section, Next Gen Racing for the PlayStation. 99 English pennies. This is awesome. It's a racing game, obviously. You uh, fly around landscapes in uh, fast jets hugging the ground, it's very tough but what other game can you play while you're racing while listening to the music from the Kevin and Perry film Americans might not know what that is but look it up, it's awesome and the music is even more awesome and this is awesome and I shall be viewing this very very shortly okay. right, parcels <coughs> number one and I do have another one of these coming uh, the mail very shortly, but as that one arrived today, so waiting for it went out the window. So we'll just run under this one for now. And we have oh Banjo Kazooie for the N64. I love this game. Did quite well on this when I was young. Younger. Very good. Love that game. Uh, I think that cost me about Five pound, probably a bit overpriced, but hey, there we go. Good game, good game, good going. Good going. Right, I'm gonna move the camera slightly to get this one. And this is the star of today's show. If we've got time, I'll unbox it as well. I know what's in here. Well, <laughs> it should be in here. So let's unwrap it. It looks like uh, the roll mail have slightly helped me here. So I'll just move around the camera. I'm gone before I start. Upside down. Get a bit of brown stuff. Just be wrapped here in bubble wrap. That's a good thing about deliveries like this. You get to play with the bubble wrap later. And inside we have one slightly dusty, but not too bad condition. Uh, Astronic MPU 1000 microprocessor TV entertainment system. I wonder if this is intelligent television. We shall see. And what time have we got? Four minutes fifty-seven. Oh yeah, plenty of time. 
Well, I'll have an unboxing of it, eh? Shall I? We'll click around the box. Cartridge system provides hundreds of game options. Full colour system, always important. Realistic sound effects. I want the unrealistic sound effects. Simply plugs it into an aerial socket of any UHF TV. I hope so. Distributed by Advanced Consumer. Yeah, okay. Same stuff on that side. Yeah. And ow, boring on the bottom. Uh, we get some uh, pictures of the games, but it's all artwork. There are no actual game representations in them. And then we get some pictures of somebody. Very happy family unit there. Right. Let's see what we got. Should have three games in this. I don't know what they all are. Right, we've got Super Maze for the Ace Tronic. I'll do a separate video where we'll fire this all up and have a look at the games. But for now, we'll just unbox it. Super Maze. Olympics. I bet you can guess what's uh, what that game is. Bong. Oh, need a dust in here. It's a bit dusty. Uh, sea attack. Hmm, that could be interesting. All boxed. This is nice. That's the nice thing about these old Pong games. Just quickly show you the cartridge. Uh, these old Pong systems, they always seem to come complete boxed, which is nice. But you don't get that so often with the modern stuff. There we go. He's trying to get. That's your cartridge. That's a generic design for them all. Obviously. Right, let's have a look. Put that back in its packaging. Safely on the side. Right, what do we have here? Controller. Dusty controller. Let's bring this thing out. There we go. Oh. Some good stuff in there, actually. Let's have a look at the console itself. Right. I believe it's all hardwired in, so. Put them this inside. He even got the original uh, films, which is also quite nice. Okay, that's a bit of a mess at the moment. Let's see what we can quickly sort out. Be a little day unwrapping. Right, it's a bit dusty. I'm gonna have to uh, give it a bit of a scrub up. So it's been a damp area too. Right, we've got overall. It looks alright. Do uh, a good scrub up. We've got two controllers, non-auto-centering analog sticks. Gee. Two of them. What's that say? Short P. They feel fine. And there's the console itself, on and off. Load program, which you have to press twice before any game will start. Once you put the cartridge in. Two overlays. Can you see that? Yep. Yeah. Two overlays. Let's go in there. Ooh, what's this? 3001 cartridge overlay. Looks upside down. I don't know what that's about. <coughs> and the special purpose cartridge overlay. One there, one there. Okie dokie. And. Yeah. SC battle cartridge. Oh, it's instructions. Yes, not uh, not hugely complex. One page. Another one of them there. Super moons and the Ace Tronic Owners Club. Your chance to join for free. I've always wanted to send one of these off and see what happens. I bet bugger all. But there we go. So I shall clean this baby up. And uh, we'll do a. <coughs> oh, hang on. Yep, got more, got more. <sighs> Missed that one. The uh, microprocessor TV entertainment system structure book. Also very nice to have. So there we go. Right, I shall uh, get it cleaned up and plug it in, and we'll do a first, uh, what I like to call, well, it's when you first turn them on, but I like to call them. As I like telescopes too, I like to call it the first light. So we're going to do a first light video on it and see how it plays. Looking good. Cheers. Oh, there we go. One last thing. Cheers.